so many of your comments have been very problematic. First, trying to isolate, okay, the coloured people that are British, okay, from English people. I mean, we all know the facts. We've all grown up here. But you're trying to isolate us, okay? I was born and bred here. I'm British and I'm proud, okay? Now, um, the other things you said was, oh, um, you spoke about the 1970s and you said, oh, what contributions have your ancestors made in World War One and World War Two? And then you also said, be grateful, um, that show gratitude that the English let your family come to the land. <sighs> For one, sorry, my ancestors never had a free card to just come here and be like, oh yeah, you can relax now and have a better life here. They worked their bottoms off. They sacrificed their lives, right? At least 89,000, at least a minimum of 89,000 Muslims, right? Sacrificed their lives. They were killed in World War I right and you're telling me what contributions do they make and you're telling me that i should be grateful right <laughs> show gratitude that the english let your family come to the land well i'm sorry i'm not the one that should be grateful if anything i should be telling you to be grateful that my ancestors helped keep britain safe helped keep europe safe right because they sacrificed their lives and britain needed them I don't go around saying this to people and being like, you should be grateful, it was my ancestors. But you know what, ignorant people like you, yes, I would definitely say that to ignorant people like you. How dare you think that I should be thankful? How dare you think that I should be thankful that the English let me stay here? When my ancestors, yeah, they earned the right to live here and they sacrificed and the ones who didn't survive sacrificed their lives, they were killed, okay? fighting for Europe, fighting for Britain, and you're telling me that I should be thankful. Absolutely ridiculous. Your comments, the ignorance in your comments is astronomical. So why don't you have a look at this? The forgotten Muslim heroes who fought for Britain in the trenches. The stories of the 2.5 million Muslims who travelled to Europe to fight for the Allies during the First World War I are finally being told. Yeah, you were, you were saying what contributions do they make in World War One? And I told you at least 89,000 Muslims were killed and a lot more Muslims came, okay, to Europe. And they came fighting, okay, <sighs> leaving families behind and leaving all sorts. And you, 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 are, you are trying to say that I owe them a thanks. No, thank you. I'm still grateful that I live in the UK, but I do not need to say thanks to anyone. And it's my God-given right to live in the country that I'm born in.